So let's get straight into it. I came across this article where it says J. Cole reportedly advised by Schoolboy Q to basically bow out the beef. And I've always been a Schoolboy Q fan just because, like, you know, I'm a fan of character. I'm a fan of code. I'm a fan of values. That's pretty. That's probably why I probably love TDE because they still move by those, you know, those things that I grew up on. But to hear that, you know, Schoolboy Q basically pulled J. Cole to the side at the Dreamville concert and, um, and told him, like, man, what, what's about to go down, man? You don't really want to be in the middle of it because I honestly think J. Cole thought this was his rap. And, you know, just having that understanding that this can go further than that and Schoolboy Q advising him, like, look, bro, just in case if it's, you know, this and that, man, I advise you, man, you always been a Kendrick Lamar fan just step away and kind of like just let this shit play out between them two. And it take a real nigga to even do that, but it take even a real nigga to even listen and then be able to, you know, make your next move your best move. And Cole did that. And now we seeing shots is fired at niggas house, um, all type of shit, you know, niggas shit. I think uh, Drake's store just got vandalized and, and uh, I think London or UK somewhere. So it's like, you know, now, it's about to get real. And the moment you start talking about people's wives and their mother, it ain't really no coming back from that. And, you know, Cole is one of those dudes. He he bikes in New York. He, he You know, he's a civilian, but he's not a civilian is what I want to say. Like, it's been known many a times that people see Cole in the streets, just walking around, showing love. And when you in the smoke like this, you really can't move like that no more. It's really like up. And so... Yeah, I mean, you know, shout out to Cole, man. I When he first bowed out, oh, everybody was like, oh, talking bad on his name, this and that. It's this rap. But, you know, those same people that would talk like that be the same people that when shit pop off, ain't nowhere to be found. So, you know, that's why you got to always make your, you know, your own decisions, especially when, like he said, it, would, it didn't sit right with me in my heart. That's what he stated. He said afterwards, you know, I was thinking about it and really that ain't me. And I think it just takes a different type of man slash human being to be able to really check yourself. And he did that. So shout out to Schoolboy Q for the, you know, just being a real nigga. And then shout out to J. Cole for just taking that initiative, saying like, you know, whatever the people going to think, it is what it is. But just for me to sleep back, just for me to sleep good at night and for me to feel good. I'm going to go ahead and just bow out gracefully. And, you know, I think he made the the right move, in my opinion. So, yeah, seeing this, I just want to, you know, give you my, my thoughts on it. And, um, yeah. So, there you have it. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Make sure you turn on your post notifications. Sheesh.